How is it going today? Lola Dwayne. My name is Jasmine. We're doing Jazz. Today we have for you, what if episode eight. Eight? Eight. Episode eight. Okay. What if Ultron mm -hmm. won? Oh my god, before we get into this review, uh. we just we just want to make sure. If you guys haven't got your request, please follow us on our social media is in the link in the description below. And don't forget to subscribe, subscribe. and like the video. Alright, let's talk about it, Jazz. Okay, first of all, before we even get into the episode, I just want to say I appreciate the episode yeah. for the reason that I think a lot of people overlook the importance and heaviness mm -hmm. of the Age of Ultron movie as far as the MCU goes. Yeah. Because like a lot of things happen. In that it, movie, it did and happen because of that movie. It that did. a lot of people don't like talk about. Everybody talks about Civil War and stuff like that, but nobody talks about Age of Ultron like ever. Like, and this is why. This is why we should because if he did succeed, Ooh. it'd be a problem. Okay, it'd Ultron. be a big problem if he got Vision's body. If he was successful and got into Vision's body mm -hmm. and you know did yeah. everything that he was supposed to do, because like even like when they when he showed like him. Encountering Thanos and Thanos. Like he, Thanos he, came, literally, he saw him and eliminated him immediately. Uh, it, it was like and, zoom, and then Thanos just whoop, like, yeah. I was like, what? And I thought that was so funny because I'm like, okay, Vision probably could have done that. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Depending on how the writers felt. <laughs> I was about to say, I don't know. Because the writers kind of just been killing Vision at every chance. They've been they killing. Look, look, look. I feel like I've seen Vision look, die like at least four look, different Look, Vision been dying. And this yep. one of series, Iron Man been dying. Yep. Thanos been dying. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I don't know. But I feel like Vision might have been able to like go mm -hmm. toe to toe with Thanos had he had like that mindset to do that. I don't yeah. know, I feel like his mindset is completely different from Ultron. Like his is more peaceful. Yeah, like, rather than well, like yeah, you, you Ultron's could, is. Ultron's like, Vision, I'm elite. Yeah, Vision like, had, Vision had like humanity to him, I feel like. He was in love with Scarlet he's Witch. He was in love with Scarlet That's Witch. That's another thing. That's another thing. And he wasn't, like, Ultron is like calculated. He's like, I'm gonna take care of I'm, the problem. I'm, uh, you know what I'm saying? And, you humans know. Humans are sickness. Yes, yeah, yes. He so was 100%. Humans are sickness. Get him out of here. Yeah. <laughs> and, and this life, we need peace. So, mm -hmm. and it was just, this episode was just great, okay? We started off, we see Hawkeye, we see Black Widow, mm -hmm. and they're going to a certain location in Russia mm -hmm. to get Armin Zola. What? Yeah, he still he still exists. And, and yeah, and then she don't forget she got red. But I'm pretty sure shield. that was the last one because Hawkeye was threatening him with like a drop of water to like get into his circus. And yeah. he was like, no, no, no. Okay. Yeah. So that must have been the last location that yeah. he's like available at. Yeah. So I thought that was cool. Yeah, I thought that was cool. And then the, I thought I thought it was cool because remember in Age of Ultron. Ultron was trying to get the nuclear codes, but Tony Stark mm -hmm. and Jarvis was keeping them at bay and mm -hmm. changing the server so he couldn't get his hands on the code. Mm -hmm. But this one got the code yep, and, and nuclear bombed the whole world. Yeah. Everybody was done for once he set them things off. It wasn't yeah. nothing you could do. Like, yeah, and so Armin Zola was the last person to be able to, you know, try to stop, stop him because yeah. he's an AI as well. Mm -hmm. And they had to go to Russia to figure out where he was at. Mm -hmm. And then he, where he was at is where they had the big fight in Civil War. Yep. So all the callbacks was just insane. Yeah. And this Armin Zola had no, you know, when they went to the fort, the you know, the uh, the, the fort in uh, New Jersey. Mm -hmm. Can't remember what it was exactly called right now at this moment. But remember, they had talked to Armin Zola. That was in Winter Soldier. And that, mm -hmm. that he had no memory of what happened there. So they had to catch him up to speed. They, they uploaded him in the Ultron bot. He said it didn't work. And then this, all that's going on, all that's happening, Ultron over here fighting the Watcher. Let's talk about it. Man, first of all, when he discovered the Watcher's presence, I knew yeah. that that was a problem because like, it was like he already like wiped out everybody yep. he in went the to, universe. He went to Asgard. Yeah. In the first place, he went he to, went, to he Asgard. Went everywhere. He yes. went to Asgard, he destroyed, you know, people of Earth. Ego, the living planet. Yeah, ego. Xandar. Um, yep. It was just like... He went everywhere just deleting just everybody. everybody. Then they had that epic battle with Captain Marvel. Mm -hmm. Oh, that was fire. I was like, and she yo. was going toe to toe with him. Yeah, she went all the way in the Earth core. I was yeah. like, yo, what the heck? Yeah. But he said, nice try. I, I'm Ultron. But I was so scared because, like, he just looked, he just looked scary, especially with, like, the red on red eyes and stuff. Yeah. And so when the Watcher was talking... He was like, he was like, you know, bored because you know nothing else. There was nothing else for him to wipe out. So he nah. was just like, oh, my mission is complete. What now? Yeah. And then he's hearing a 
thing talking about like, oh yeah, he has no purpose anymore. Then I saw him like, his eye like twitch to the left. I was like, oh no, you don't know he's right there. And cause that's the same thing that Dr. Strange sensed when he was like gathering all that power yeah. and sucking up all those like, yeah. Creatures strange. And stuff. What is it? Strange yeah. Supreme. Yeah. Yeah. Strange Supreme. And like he noticed his presence, but he couldn't locate him. Mm -hmm. But with uh, with Ultra Vision, basically having yeah. all the stones, I think mm -hmm. that's what helped him locate. Yeah. Where the Watcher was. Yeah, I was like, because the Watcher was like, oh snap, what the? Yeah, because yeah. he broke in there. He's yeah. Like, okay, I found you, and I was like, oh. No. What? I was like, what? Yeah. And, and then, uh, yeah, go ahead. I was gonna say, and, and that was just a crazy scene of him breaking in there, mm -hmm. and then their fight was epic. You know? I didn't know to watch him fight. I didn't know to watch him throw hands, too. I he all of a sudden got this fight. armor, know, yeah. and they just started cosmic, but he still got folded. He still got, I mean, but he put up a good he fight. He put up though. a good he, fight, but he was about to get folded. He just get clapped, like, easily. He grabbed so. that watcher's big dome. He grabbed that football, that Stewie Griffin head. He mm -hmm. said, and then he was like, yeah, good. And then, you know, Ultron's about to, and, but he, but he you ran. know, you know what's great though? Like every time when they was fighting, the fight was just, it's incredibly epic mm -hmm. because they had like that. Showing different universes. Just showing you. With you every remember, punch. Every punch that was destroying another universe. Then all of a sudden Ultron chomped on a whole universe. I was yeah. like, yo, what and the? Ate and, and ate it. And ate it. I was like, And what? if you looked at the universes in one of them, it looked like Cap. Was, was gonna be the president because he yeah. was like getting sworn in, and I was like, "Yo, is nobody gonna talk about Captain America being the president?" Brazil, right. Like, and then I want to see that. What if? Like, like, I want to see what happens there. Like. <laughs> but it was just insane, and so I'm just thinking, like, "Yo, this this episode was just crazy on so many mm. levels. A lot was done." And I realized that in this episode, they actually had the sacrifice scene. Like, you know how where Hawkeye and uh, Widow had to sacrifice one of the other oh, and and souls, and so put yep. a soul stone. And in this one, it was like. Not for the soul stone, but they were sacrificing each other for like who would live and continue. Like, to, and this time yeah. it was Hawkeye mm -hmm. that sacrificed himself rather yeah. than Black Widow. So I thought that yeah. was cool. I too. thought that so, shot like, was amazing yeah. when he was going against the Ultron bots. Mm -hmm. I, I I loved it. I was like, but you know, he he decided he didn't want to live anymore. He almost his gave family up. Family was gone. Yeah, the Watcher was like watching yeah. him, and he was like, I can't intervene. Mm -hmm. I can't, but he, he wanted, wanted to. to. He was He's like, like I this want to. He's like, Ultron. Right there. Yeah, Ultron. Yeah, Ultron. Yeah, Ultron was like, this this robot is. Too big for his bridges. He need to humble himself, but he couldn't. Yeah. He doesn't want to intervene. Mm -hmm. But now, at this point, because at the end of the episode, we learned that he has to intervene. He had to run away because he was about to die from Ultron. He ran away and went to uh, Strange Supreme. I that was, was stuck like, in his own little universe. universe cube, not cube, but like little Circle. thing. Circle. Yeah, yeah, that he's destined low. to sit there like basically forever. Yeah, and he had to go to him for help. And I'm yep. like, oh, I said, no. wow. And that was one of my other favorite episodes was uh, that, Strange yeah, Supreme. Yeah, so it was really good. Yeah, because he hit like an absolute point in his universe mm -hmm. where he had to, you know, he had, you know, the girl that he was pursuing. She was fated to die. Fated to die every time. Yeah. And so, and so he tried to change that with the time stone and mm -hmm. he kept absorbing different demons mm -hmm. to change it. He finally was change able to change it. Red. Yeah, Charlie changed it, but then the whole universe collapsed. Mm -hmm. And then the watcher said, I care to help you. And mm -hmm. did. But now he's back. And now it looks like He's gonna have to get this, like, he's gonna create his own multiverse of Avengers yep. to go fight the against Ultron. Left, right? Yeah, the ones that are left. So yeah. we, we got, we got, we got uh, Star Lord T'Challa, we got, uh, we got Killmonger Black Panther. Mm. And we just got a whole bunch of characters and what ifs that he's gonna have to draw from. We got Party exactly. Thor. Exactly. Because that's where we saw Ultra Vision first. Mm -hmm. with, and then the Watcher looks surprised. So is that the. Is that the same watcher? Now think about it. Is that the same watcher or is that a different watcher from a different universe? I think it's the same watcher. I, don't, I think that like he didn't expect him to pop up that first time in Thor's episode but because after that, then this happened. So he was like, I already know that he's there. So that's why he's not surprised. I think he was just surprised that he knew where he was. Maybe. I think that's what happened this episode. Hmm. Cause I'm like, when he did he? Cause last time he was like, where did you come from, basically? Yeah. But since that was like episode, what was that one episode ago? Or that was one episode ago. One episode ago. One episode ago, he popped up, and that's what made him go like, what? But like ever since then, he has the knowledge that he exists, so he's yeah. not gonna be surprised if he sees him again this episode. Yeah, but that's but he true. was surprised that he knew where he was. He was just maybe. Like, oh my god. Yeah, maybe so. Maybe mm -hmm. so. I don't know. We gonna figure it out because you don't know. There's, there definitely has to be other watchers. But mm -hmm. we don't know if like every universe has their own watcher. Yeah, if it's a different person. Yeah, or is it just one watcher that does it? Or does it have quadrants? We don't know. Yeah, it has to be other watchers. 
and do they have watchers and watchers? Mm -hmm. <laughs> We're gonna figure it out, but this F Ultron was incredible. I loved yeah. it. I know, I know like the thing with Thanos and him coming early was kind of weird because it's like, who did he get the soul, phone, soul stone from? Because Gamora yeah, was on the other planet. We, they clearly saw the Guardians of the Galaxy and yeah. him and this whole bunch of stuff. And we'll figure out next episode, hopefully, yeah. and see what's up. But uh, this episode definitely was heat. Yeah. 10 out of 10. We had to talk about it. We're going to talk about the other episodes, too, once yeah. like, the last episode comes out. It's yeah. just that we want to talk about it all together, but we didn't know that this episode was going to be this heat. So like, we that's had why we talk to about talk this about one. it specifically but yes. we're gonna talk about all the other ones later for sure so. so yeah that was our review and you guys can let us know what you guys think is gonna happen in the next episode and mm -hmm. what might go down anyway guys comment below let us know what you think. don't forget to like subscribe and share this